Good afternoon, my dear children and my dear parents. How are you all? I hope you all are fine. Children, have you said your prayers today? Yes, it is very much that you say your prayers every day before your studies. Children, make it a regular habit to say your prayers every day. Okay? Right. Along with your prayers, you also have to say your national anthem. Right. Children, it's time for the video now. Teacher is coming with a new lecture. Come on, wish your teacher good afternoon. All of you together. Yes. Say good afternoon, teacher. Very good. Yes. Children, you just had your exam, right? Your class test. Right? How many children appeared in that? Mm, very less children appeared. Yes, children. And the paper was very easy, right? Your English and your maths paper. Have you learnt your poetry and story? Yes, even that was your exams, right? Even story and poetry also was your exams. So, along with your English, along with your maths, you also have to study your poetry and story. Okay, children? Yes, even that is very important. Okay, right. So, children, now we'll start with the lecture now. We'll start with the video. Okay? Yes. So, my dear children, I'll give you five minutes. Kindly prepare yourself. Get ready with the book, a pencil, your eraser. Today, we are going to do a new activity. Okay? Today, we are going to do new activity in the lesson number book, phone number book. So, kindly open your book and give me five minutes. I will prepare my book on the board. So, so children, are you ready with your books? Your pencil, your eraser? Yes. So, today we are going to start with a new topic. Today's date is 13th January. And teacher has brought the activity page number 16. Okay? Page number 16. Before, before we see to page number 16 activity, let us see what was the homework for the last lecture. Children, have you done the page number 15 lecture? Yes, the page number 15 was activity match the same letters. Have you done it? Have you done this homework children? Yes, this was one time and A to Q was three times. Have you done your homework A to Q? Yes, A to Q three times. Children, there are two lines of M given. Two letter uh, M two lines are given. N two lines are given, O two lines, P two lines and Q two lines. Children, in this activity you have to write the full book. Okay, you have to write the full page. But I have shown you only few activity. Okay, few lines. So, your homework is page number 16. Page number 16. And also I will be giving you homework A to Q. Okay, A to Q. So, today we are going to do activity page number 16. So, kindly op uh, open your phone number book. Page number 16, pencil eraser. Okay, now we are going to start to letter M. Okay, letter M. Okay, are, have you, are you ready with your book? Pencil rubber? Yes. So, now put your pencil over here. Red line to blue line. Put a standing line and then M. M. Okay? M. Yes. Here also M. Okay? M for mango. M for monkey. M for mouse. M for man. Okay? M. Right? The next letter is N. Next letter is N. So, we are going to write N over here. Red line to blue line. Okay? Slanting line and then on top. M. This is M. M for mango. M for monkey. M for mouse. M for man. So this is N. N for nose. N for neck. Okay? Yes. Put a standing line, red line to blue line. Put a slanting line and then go up. N, capital N. 
Next, we go to again red line to blue line, standing line, put a slanting line and then again go on top, end. Again we go red line to blue line, standing line, then put a slanting line and then again you go on top. Okay, this is end. Now we go to next letter O. We go to next letter O. M, N, O, P, Q. Okay. M, N, O, P, Q. Okay. Yes. So now we go to O. Go to next line. O. Red line to blue line. Put a circle around it. Okay. Red line to blue line. Red line to blue line. Put a O. Again we go for O. O for owl. O for owl. O for octopus. O for ostrich. Okay. O for ox cart. Right. O for ox cart. O for orange. Right. We have completed with M. N. O. What is the next letter children? M. N. O. P. P. So now we write P now. Red line to blue line, standing line, and then we put a half curve to the blue line. P, P for parrot, P for peacock, P for parrot, P for peacock, okay? Now we go again for P, standing line, then half curve, P for pencil, P for pen, P for pencil, P for pen. P for pencil, P for pen. Okay? We have completed with M, M for mango, N, N for nose, O, O for orange, P, P for pencil, and now we are going for Q. M, N, O, P, Q. M, N, O, P, Q. Yes. So now we write Q. Put a circle again and then you put a cross, slanting line to Q. Again you go for circle and then a slanting line for Q. Again you put a circle and then a slanting line to Q. Again you go for circle. And then a slanting line to Q. Okay? Yes. So this is page number activity, page number 16, book number 4. M, M for mango, N, N for nose, O, O for orange, P, P for pencil, Q, Q for queen, Q for queen, Q for quail, Q for quiver, Q for question mark. Q for question mark, okay? Yes, so this is our M to Q, okay? So this is your homework, page number 16. Children, here two, two lines are given. I have given only one line. So you have to complete the full page to page number 16 one time, okay? This is your page number 16. Okay, kindly copy first. I'll come back to you again. So children, now we are going to learn the alphabets. Okay, along with the alphabets, we are also going to learn the pictures. Okay, we have to revise it because we are going to get, now we have going to be having our second unit test. Okay, yes, we have just finished our class test, but now we are going, going to go have our second unit test. So for that, we have to get ourselves prepared. Okay, we have to get ourselves prepared. Okay, yes. So now A4. Apple. Okay, there will be three, four questions re related to the pictures saying match the picture, circle the correct picture, write the first alphabet to the picture or you can say draw the picture. Okay, anything. Anything can come. Okay, and two numbers, two alphabets, you're going to have missing and write A to Q. Okay, so these are the few questions which you are going to have for the second unit test. Okay, I can give anything. So kindly get prepared for your exam. 
Okay? I'll be going to give you a revision. Okay? I'll be giving you a revision for the second unit test. In the next lecture, I may give you revision. But you have to learn the pictures. Okay? Yes. A for apple. A for axe. Okay? Yes. B for ball. B for bat. C for cap. C for cat. D for dice. D for drum. D for dog. D for duck. D for donkey. E for eyes. E for ears. E for elephant. E for elbow. E for egg. F. F for frog. F for fish. F for fig. F for fan. F for frog. G. G for goat. G for girl. G for grapes. G for gun. H. H for hen. H for hat. H for helicopter. H for house. I. I for ink pot. I for island. I for igloo. I for ice cream. J. J for jar. J for jug. J for jellyfish. J for jelly. J for jam. And J for Joker. K. K for Kite. K for Kangaroo. K for Kiwi. K for Kettle. K for Key. L. L for Leaf. L for Lock. L for Lamp. L for Lion. L for Lemon. M. M for mango. M for mug. M for mouse. M for monkey. M for man. N. N for nose. N for neck. N for nest. N for nib. N for necklace. O. O for orange. O for octopus. O for ox. O for ox cart, O for ox octopus, O for ostrich. P, P for pot, P for plant, P for pen, P for pencil, P for pan, P for parrot, P for peacock. Q, Q for queen, Q for question mark, Q for quill, Q for quilt, Q for quiver, Q for quail. Okay? So these are these are the we have completed to A to Q. So uh, now we are going to have uh, A to Q. We are going to write on the board A to Q, and that is your homework for three times. Okay? Yes. So I give you five minutes. Kindly copy fast. Yes, children. Today I am going to give you a new topic. We are not going to write A to Q, but we are writing missing alphabets. Okay? We are writing missing alphabets so that you may have a practice. Okay? We have, today we are going to write missing alphabets. A to Q you have written many times. Okay? Now, by now you must be knowing how to write A to Q. Okay? Today we are going to write missing alphabets. Missing alphabets. Okay? This is M dash dash P. Okay, here, here there's a dash, there's a dash, here there's a dash. Okay, I'm just writing the dash here so that you can see. Okay, yes. M dash dash P. A dash C dash. I dash dash L E dash G dash N dash P dash Okay, we have completed our portion till A to Q 
so on that basis i have given you missing alphabets okay so now we'll start a to q a first letter is m so we'll go till m a b c d e f g h i j k l m m we have come to m after m what comes children what comes after m capital n okay yes capital n m m n o m n o m n o p m n o p m n o p right next is a okay a a after a comes b yes so we write here b b for ball a b c d a b c d okay next we have i a b c d e f g h i after i comes children what comes after i j yes j comes j after j we have capital k we have capital k i j k l i j k l okay next we have e a b c d e after e we have capital f capital f capital f e f g h capital h capital h okay e f g h yes next letter is n a b c d e f g h i j k l m n n we go to n now n is after n comes o after n comes o n m n o p q okay yes so this is our missing alphabets okay so you have to copy this down this is not there in the long book page number uh, long book number 4 okay this i have given you on my own so you have to copy this from the board okay yes missing alphabets m n o p a b c d okay you have to fill in the dash yellow color is the dash and white color is i what i have given you as a question okay m n o p a b c d i j k l e f g h n o p q okay n o p q so this is for three times this homework is for three times this homework is for three times okay missing alphabet is for three times and you also have your homework page number 16 okay yes you have to complete this page you have to complete this you have to trace here write m two lines n two lines o two lines p two lines and q two lines you have to complete this page and you have to send the copy to me okay so you have two homeworks page number 16 and missing alphabets three times kindly copy fast i'll come back to you so children do you know what is your homework right you have missing alphabets three times and page number 16 activity m n o p q okay yeah that you have to write two two lines one page okay in the activity book no writing in the written line book no writing okay yes so now children i'll come back to you in the next lecture with the revision okay i'll come back to you in the next lecture for the with the revision 
okay i'll bring for you the revision for the second unit test okay so i love you and miss your english teacher saying thank you and goodbye take care stay home stay safe don't go out and kindly send the homework to me on time